What's going on guys, Jiggles here, and today I'm going to be showing you the three Hogwarts secrets if you go into uh, your challenges. I have 100% challenges, I just finished these. You go all the way down to exploration. The last one is solving Hogwarts secrets and you have to solve and find three of them. I'm going to show you all three of those in this video today. Uh, you don't have to do them in any specific order, as long as you find them and solve them, you'll be able to do it just that way. So the first one we're going to go to is on this bridge right here. So if you go to the Great Hall over here to this flag, and you go to Viaduct Courtyard, you TP there. Alright, you TP here, and it's right at this bridge. You must have a uh, Confringo on, or any fire. So it's these four right here on this bridge where all of these are they have these symbols and you're able to rotate them this way you can rotate them either way but they have to be on fire good for you in order for them to rotate and then it's just this little pedestal right here it has them lined up the symbols with the numbers one two three and four so let me go ahead and put these two on fire and i'll show you guys how to do it you guys can probably figure it out for yourself after this but it's pretty much all you have to do i've already figured it out so i'm not sure if it'll open again um, so what is this one? This one's the four X cross. So that's three, uh, that's four. So we can just spin this to four. And then this one is the double circles with the line. So that is two. So we'll put that to two. And then the other ones are one and three. So the triangle with the circle is three. And the triangle with the lines is one. So you come all the way down here. Triangle with the circle is three. And the triangle with the lines is well, is that what I said? So then once you do that, it should... This will open up down here, and you'll be able to go down. So that is the first one, as long as you come down here. Um, and then there'll be one or two chests down here. You just go all the way down here, and then there's a chest or two down here. I don't remember. I already got them. Uh, there's a chest here, and then there might be another one. But let's go to the second Hogwarts secret. Alright, so your second Hogwarts secret is going to be at this flag over here in the south wing. You're going to go to the Clock Tower Courtyard. Alright, so once you make it to Clock Tower Courtyard, it's these symbols on here, and then these doors that Rebellion. you use Rebellio. Uh, since I already did, it's not going to show up, but it's these doors that kind of look like this. It's blue, it'll pop up, and you use the symbols, and this right here. So you got to time it just right. Use Arresto Momentum. To slow it down as these doors are opening and closing really fast and then you'll be able to go through it and open the chest that's in here um, that would be the night symbol for this first one down here so it looks like just, just like that you'll be able to time it just right and then the other ones you go through this door and they're all upstairs so the way to do this, you keep using uh, Revelio, they're big blue doors. Um, like I said, it's not going to pop up since I already did them, but the second one is right here. The symbols are going to be on the nice uh, big metal that's blocking the door. And then you can time it just right. I think this one is the... I don't remember which one. You just Arrest use the momentum. momentum as it goes like, over it because it times it with the opening of the door. And then as you do that, you got to time it just right and go through the door before Arrest of Momentum stops and the door closes. And your third one, you're going to go up these stairs. You can e keep using uh, Revelio. You'll be able to find it, but it's right here on the right side. Use these symbols again. Use Arrest of Momentum and time it just right to go through the door. And then the fourth and final door, you go up these stairs on the left all the way up and it's right through this door here you cannot use the spell through this so what you have to do is you have to before you even come up here you should double check to see what symbol it is if you don't remember use a wrestle momentum time it just right and then go back up you have plenty of time as you as long as you time it perfectly you have enough time to go up and go through the door and get your chest that is in there. Once you get all four of the chests, you will complete the second secret, and it'll pop up saying that you completed it. And that is the Clock Tower Courtyard secret. I'll take you to your third secret right now. All right, so your third and final secret, you're going to go here in the Grand Staircase, and you're going to go to the Trophy Room. Once you come here to the Trophy Room, you're going to go to your right, and you're going to sprint all the way up you need to go through this little gated doorway up these stairs right here. You're going to go all the way up. It's a lot of stairs, actually. you got to go all the way up. You can keep using Revelio. There's some chests and rooms along the way. 
if you want to get those before you get all the way up to where you got to go because we got to go up a lot of stairs but you come up here you keep going all the way up these stairs once you get here i think you have, you have to use a lohamora to get here so you must have a lohamora unlocked to do most of these but you have to go out and up these stairs out this way and you're gonna come to the headmaster's quarter Revelio, and there's gonna be a key on his desk it's gonna be the key of admittance so once you grab that you can go back down and you need to go out to the other side of the doorway that we came up so you're gonna go all the way back down after you grab the key and then you're gonna go to the right side now and you're gonna open this door as it'll have a cute little animation and then there's a chest there. You go all the way up this, but once you unlock that door, it will tell you congratulations on the third and final one. But if you come all the way up here, you will have a Revelio page up here and a little collections chest. And there also is a second chest up here, I believe. Um, and then that is all three of the Hogwarts secrets. I really hope you guys did enjoy. I've had a lot of fun in this game. I have 100% uh, completion on all of the challenges. Let me uh, go ahead and show you guys. It's Pretty awesome. 100% on everything. Combat quest, exploration, field guide pages, room of requirement. If you guys have any questions on anything, please let me know. I'd love to do some more guided content if you guys do enjoy. But those are all three of your secrets. You'll get all of your rewards. So once you go to challenges, exploration, scroll all the way down, you'll get all three of those secrets. And that was the last one I had to do. And I was able to get 100% on all of the challenges and my overall progress. But thank you guys so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. Please leave a like if this helped. Drop a sub, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.